This example will go through the steps in balancing an equation for the combustion of an alcohol, which is an organic compound made of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. The compound C12H25OH is called dodecanol or lauryl alcohol. It is used in the cosmetic industry. We're asked to balance this equation, the combustion of dodecanol in oxygen, using the lowest possible set of whole number coefficients. We start by balancing carbon atoms. We have 12 carbons on the left, so we write a 12 in front of the CO2, and now we have 12 carbons on both sides. On the left side, we have 25 plus 1, or a total of 26 hydrogen atoms. So we write a 13 in front of the water, because 2 times 13 is equal to 26. So we have 26 hydrogen atoms on both sides, so hydrogen is now balanced. Now we need to balance oxygen atoms. There are 2 times 12, or 24, oxygens in the CO2, and 1 times 13, or 13 oxygens in the water. Thus we have a total of 24 plus 13, which is 37 oxygens on the right side. So to balance the oxygens, we need to have a total of 37 oxygens on the left side. A good way to do this is to temporarily block out the O2 and observe that we have one oxygen in the C12H25OH. So the O2 must supply 36 more oxygen atoms to give us the 37 oxygens we need on the left. For O2 to supply 36 oxygen atoms, it must have a coefficient of 18, because 2 times 18 is equal to 36. Now, we have 37 oxygens on both sides of the equation, so oxygen is balanced. We're asked to balance this with the lowest possible set of whole number coefficients. And since our coefficients are all whole numbers, this is the finished balance equation for this reaction. At this point, you might want to pause the video and recheck to see that all of the atoms are balanced. 